Improving efficiency of movement through low intensity running, biking, and kayaking is the most important aspect of an endurance training program for Aura Extreme Challenge. A fun and motivating way to evaluate improvements in efficiency is the MAF test, which requires that you train with the heart rate monitor according to your own specific training zones. Your low intensity training should always be under your aerobic threshold. A simple and effective rule of thumb is the 180 rule. For example, a 40 year old should not exceed 140 beats per minute during a low intensity training session. To train smart, you should spend most of your training time in the low intensity A1 zone and only limited time in the high intensity A3 zone. Avoid training in the A2 zone as it causes non-optimal stress, which breaks down your body over time. If you follow this approach, you will run, bike, and paddle faster at the same level of effort. Use the MAF test to objectively measure this efficiency improvement over time. Step 1. Run on a treadmill at your aerobic threshold for 6 kilometers. Warm up slowly for 15 minutes. Start the test and adjust the speed of the treadmill to keep your heart rate the same. Push the lap button on your watch after each kilometer to record your time and heart rate. Step 2. Enter the average heart rate and time for each kilometer you ran. Step 3. Graph the data and save this as your baseline measurement. Step 4. Redo the test at the same heart rate every 4 to 6 weeks. If you hold your heart rate constant and cover the same distance in a shorter time, then you have improved efficiency. If for some reason your aerobic function does not improve over time, it may be because you didn't balance intensity and volume according to the 80-20 rule. Or you may have been exposed to other types of mental, chemical, or emotional stress that affected your progress.